Hi YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review slash haul unboxing reveal video. And um, the review is going to be on the Keep All 45 that I have in the Monogram Macassar canvas. Um, this video was requested by Simhi CMT, it was, and Nastasia M53. And um, let me just say, if you haven't seen or viewed Nastasia's Louis Vuitton collection, I don't even mind. Pause my video right now and go jump on over to her page because it is phenomenal. I will I'll leave a link below so you guys can go and check her out. And, um, yeah, her collection is, like, outstanding. Like, her, among others, it's her channel and her videos that actually inspired me to create a channel of my own. So, yeah, it's totally worth checking out. And, um, yeah, she asked me to do this review for her a few weeks ago, I think a week or two ago, and I didn't have the time, so I couldn't get it up there fast enough, but I saw on her Instagram that she actually went and picked up a Keep All 45 in the monogram canvas, so you can go and check that out on her page as well, and, um, so yeah, let's get started. Um, so what I have here is the Keep All 45 in the Monogram Macassar. This is the bandolier version, so it comes with the detachable shoulder strap. You can buy the bag without the shoulder strap, but and it's like a little cheaper, but you know, I always love options, so whenever there is an option for, you know, the shoulder strap, I always go for it. And um, so yeah, the Keep Alls are part of Louis Vuitton's travel collection so it's basically it's you know travel luggage it's a duffel bag a mini duffel bag i guess um it's basically the keep alls are like oversized speedies and you know the the whole shape of the speedy is based off of the keep all you know the keep all was in production before the speedy and um yeah you know i've had this bag for about a year now I think I bought it last year for my birthday and um, honestly I have to say this is probably of all the bags I have this is my favorite bag from Louis Vuitton the, my favorite bag in my collection um, you know I think it's beautiful it's it's masculine it's functional you know it's you know really a key balls are just like one giant gaping hole there's no pockets or anything in key balls um you know, it just has um, a little D-ring there if you want to attach, um, you know, something, your keys or um, connect it to your wallet or something. Um, but yeah, so it's basically just one big giant hole and, um, you know, I love it. You know, it's not much. It's like really simple. Um, you know, this is how it looks on, just so you can see how it looks. It's, um, you know, it's big, but it's not, like, oversized, that it's too much. Like, I have the 55, like, which, no way I could just wear that out in the street, because it looks like, you know, I'm running away from home or something. So, um, yeah, the 45, I use this as an everyday bag as well. You know, if I'm going to go to work or something, and... You know, it's fine. It doesn't look crazy. So, um, yeah. One thing I do have to say that I don't like about key hauls and speedies as well in general is that, um, if you don't have, like, anything for the base, I went and purchased this, like, plexiglass thing from, I think it's basshapers.com or, oh, I'm not 100% sure, um, when I remember, I'll put it down in the description below, so you guys can go and check that out. But, um, without that, um, when your bags get, like, overstuffed, if, like, you know, you women out there who have, um, speedies, you know that, like, it tends to, like, sink and crush and, like, droop on the bottom, and I think that's disgusting and barbaric, so I went and purchased this, and it's, like, you know, it's really small, it's thin, you just... Stick it on the bottom of your bag. Hold on here. Let me get that in. And then, yeah, it holds the 
the shape, the base. So, you know, no matter how much I push down, like it's still, it's still solid. It's not going to droop. It's perfect, you know. So, yeah, that is my, my key ball. Um, so, you know, I love the key ball. And again, so today, you know, I woke up today and I really wasn't planning on going shopping, but you know, I went and did a little shopping. I went to go pick up one thing and you know, anyone who's a shopper, you go to get one thing and you end up with like the whole store. So, um, we'll start with the little things first. Um, so yes, I got three items today at Louis Vuitton. We'll go from smallest to biggest. And, um, one of the items I picked up is, um, a little bag charm and you know Louis Vuitton this is how they come with but you know the little box and then the dust bag and what I picked up was this it's different like it's um it's oh I forgot the name of this hold on let me just check the receipt here it is called the oh gosh the Anu Clay Musket extra large just so you can see that there um yeah there's something something clay extra large and um it's just like a giant a giant i don't know clipper attachy i don't know it's just oversized and pretty i didn't i wasn't looking to buy it i just saw it i'm like that's different it's cool and yeah so again on a bag I guess I just like attach it like that and that's how it would look on the bag um so yeah this is one of the items I picked up at Louis Vuitton and here so this is actual unboxing guys you know you're the first ones to see this I haven't opened it yet and um yep, the second item I got came in a box like this and there you go, the paper, and ta-da, I got a scarf. Um, okay, I, like, forget the name of this as well. This is the Echarp Logo Mania Ruby Scarf, and, um, so yeah, it's just, it's red and just has, like, the monogram print all over it crazy it's fun you know it's fall now I wear a lot of black and stuff this wasn't originally the color I was going to choose but you know I wasn't I'm not wearing black today but um my sales associate was wearing black so you know we had a little fashion show I had her try on all the scars and we both agreed that you know the red is probably best and um yeah so this is the scarf that I got it's really pretty it's made of, let's see if I can find this, it says Louis Vuitton Paris, made in Italy, it's 94% wool and 6% silk, if you want to check that out, and um, yeah, it's just like a beautiful scarf, like, you know, I don't really have anything bright like this in my collection, so this will be nice for the winter time. Um, Okay, and next, last but not least, oh, I picked up another bag. So, if I can get this off, um, oh, another thing, you know, I love these boxes. You know, at Louis Vuitton, you get those, those giant square ones. Um, you know, I'm always looking for these, and they're always, like, sold out, and so when I came and bought a bag and picked this up. My sales associate was nice enough to give me another box because she knows I'm always asking for them and they never have them, but um, yeah, let's get to it. The last item that I picked up at Louis Vuitton today, blah, 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 open it, here's a dust bag. Let me put this down there. And it is, believe it or not, I went and picked up another Keepall 45. I really do love this bag. It really is my favorite bag. So I guess this is how it comes. I had it hot stamped there already. They hot stamped it for me with my initials MM. Oh, 
Sorry guys, my camera just died there in the middle of me talking. So, um, again, yes, I went and picked up another Keep All 45 bandolier in the Damier Graphite collection. And, um, so, you know, when you first buy it, it comes folded like this. And, um, again, like I was saying, I had it hot stamped with my initials there. And, you know, the bag comes with a lock and key. And, um... Yeah, so, ooh, let's see, when you unfold this bag, ooh, well, let's undo this here, it is basically, here's the shoulder strap, again, it's just one giant, ooh, ooh, it's one giant, <laughs> one giant bag. Well, not giant, but not too giant. So yeah, this is the, the last th item that I picked up today. Another key ball. Um, I got, I got this honestly because, um, I have in the Dami Graphite, I have the key ball 55. And, um, you know, when I go travel, I would take my 45 in the Macassar and then my 55 in the Graphite Pro, my personal bag and my carry-on, and I didn't really like that they didn't match, so I was like, okay, what am I going to do? I'm either going to buy a Macassar in a 55 to match the 45, or get a 45 in the graphite to match the 55, and then I thought, you know, this is probably, you know, it's less flashy, and it's like, you know, more practical, I think, maybe in the future, who knows, the monogram print might be too flashy for me, so, you know, I went and picked up the Dame Graphite Keep All 45 Bandolier. And, um, yeah. So that is it for today. Um, oh guys, do not mind my nails. It was Halloween. I went out for Halloween last night. And so, you know, I painted my nails and I had them done. I was a sailor. So, you know, painted my nails with little anchors and steering wheels and fun stuff like that. Um, so, yeah. That was everything for me, so I hope you guys enjoyed my video, and um, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you all soon. Okay, bye. <laughs>